viewers welcome to my channel the technocratics and today i have must refresh your childhood memories by telling you a small trick you want to play your childhood games the i am talking about the 90s and 2000 retro games which you like to play in your childhood so if you want to refresh memory stay in this video this may be very helpful don't waste your any money buying gadgets like on amazon like uh, sega console and other console available so please stay in the video so first i may show you my settings mobile settings so here in the settings area there is option of about phone and i am showing my phone uh, it's moto e4 plus it's running on the android version 7.1.1 so let's see how to perform it so first you must have an application i will also give the link in this description do not download it from play store the nest emulator nest in your pocket as you can see please do not download this application from play store and it has all the retro games more than 1800 retro games like contra mario and tetris which you played in your childhood so let's play a small game of mario here you can see the interface is the select button then start button and arrow keys and then a and b button which you had it in the console and it's the mario which i am playing so you can see it's running classic on my phone video might be laggy because i'm recording it and the phone is not high end specified so and now let me show you contra and here is contra so you can see you can play all the games oh so you can see it's running fine on my device I will give the link in the description you can also download it and if you want to play with your gaming console or the remote of PS4 you can also play it by downloading an app from a play store known as Octopus Kinapper let me show you so here you will type Octopus Kinapper and it will load the search results as you can see how my typing is slow let me first turn on my data here yeah, the first one octopus key manual gamepad mouse keyboard you can play with any of them but your mobile should support otg connection so i have already downloaded it and you can see Here, my generic USB joystick is connected. Here, on the screen, connected devices, and I will notch Panda Nest from here. You can see that Panda Nest icon, and here you can see the mapping is buttons are on the screen. Button. This is the USB buttons. This is the up down arrow keys, and here you can adjust your key mapping by at the top corner there is a button of with the octopus so that's it in this video hope you like it please subscribe if you like thank you